hi guys welcome back to my channel i am tk beauty and in today's video we are going to be emptying the trash you guys i have accumulated a lot of stuff since i've done my last empties and this time i feel like i have a lot more food and like juice items and stuff like that to share along with all of the other stuff that i typically share with you guys i'm not even sure of all of the things that i have saved but we're going to get through what i got but before we jump into this video if you guys are not subscribed to my channel go ahead and click that subscribe button click that notification bell also so that you'll know every time I upload a new video so let's go ahead and empty the trash okay so the first two items I'm gonna start with are these uh, Trader Joe's 100% juice this is the country peach juice y'all I have been going through this juice I think I only have one more left and I think I'm gonna have to make a stop at Trader Joe's to get some more because this is really really good um, so this is how it looks um, yeah I really do like this juice so uh, I have been going through that. Some other food items that I have been going through. I shared this in my last vlog. It's the Miss Vicky's Spicy Dill Pickle Chips. These are so good. I think I'm going to have to order me a box off of Amazon because these are delicious. This is the packaging. I probably have another bag in here somewhere, but I have been going through these chips. They're so good. And I like Miss Vicky's chips, but I think these have by far been my favorite out of the chips that she she makes so I cannot wait to get some more of these so I've been going through those another bag of chips that I've been going through I picked these up from the Dollar Tree these are the Cheetos the cheddar jalapeno chips I mean it's nice if you just want like a little bit of a kick it's not like super spicy but it will give you a nice kick it's a nice change from just like the original Cheetos so I do like these so when I see them in Dollar Tree which I'm surprised they're in there but I'm happy that they are. Another item that I have gone through, it's the Shiseido Facial Cotton Pads. And I picked these up from Marshalls or TJ Maxx. And I go through these. I've gone through my Icebreakers Ice Cube Bubble Breeze Gum. I typically keep this in my car. I go through these quite often as well. The next thing that I have gotten rid of, it is the Rapid Styling Strips. When I do wash my own hair and stuff, after I get through molding it, I will use these strips and so I've gone through these I've also gone through some facial tissue that I have in my room here this is the it just says faith family and friends I get this from the Dollar Tree and I just love this the what it says on the sides so yeah I picked this up from Dollar Tree and I have gone through this I've also gone through the icebreaker ice cube Arctic Grape Gum. I picked these up from Dollar Tree. Again, I also keep these in my car. When I can't find that big container, then I'll just pick these up from the Dollar Tree. So I go through these also. Something else that I go through that I really, really love. Um, I've had to cut back on these, but these are the Sour Patch Kids Peach Candy. Yeah, this is just ridiculous, ridiculous. But I love this candy so good okay i'm sure i have some more bars of soap some i didn't even get a chance to say but i have quite a few bars of soap i always go through bars of soap the one that i have been loving recently i did mention in a vlog that i picked up from the dollar tree this is the dove gentle exfoliating bar soap i really really like this now the shea butter one is my favorite one but this is right after that one i've really been enjoying this soap and then I also like the the sensitive skin one. Um, they don't have anything else in the Dollar Tree. I like this one. I like the sensitive skin one. And then I do get the original ones. And I, I get the shea butter ones. But I've been using these a lot more than the shea butter ones. I also have gone through the Palmer's Cocoa Butter Formula with Vitamin E Body Oil. I really like this stuff. Actually, actually I love this stuff. I like to use this to seal in any body creams or body butters that I use. I really do like this product. Another product that I've gone through, this is from the Dollar Tree. This is by Bolero. This is the Soothing Facial Toner in Cucumber and Aloe. I love anything with cucumber and aloe and it has been really hard to kind of find some of the stuff that Bolero used to have with the cucumber in it, especially like my facial mist. I don't know what they're doing, but I need them to get that back. But I did enjoy this toner if I see it again I will definitely repurchase this another toner that I go through it is by elf this is the holy hydration keep your balance toner 
This has hyaluronic acid with hazel and aloe in it. I really do like this toner. I feel like for the $8 that you pay, it's not bad at all. It definitely helps to balance my skin to bring it back to its normal pH. I really do like this and this is by far my favorite toner by e.l.f. I have tried another toner by e.l.f. I liked it but this one is my favorite so I will probably continue to repurchase this. Another product that surprisingly I went through this pretty quickly. This is by Glossier. This is their After Bomb Moisture Barrier Recovery Cream. I picked this up during one of the Sephora sales and I wasn't really sure how I was gonna like this product but honestly I really did like this product and I thought originally that I was going to I think just either use this in the winter or use this during the summertime. It wasn't like super thick. I felt like it was a nice mix between it wasn't too thick but it wasn't too thin. It was really nice so I ended up using this all year round. Not that I would not repurchase this but I feel like I would want to try something else before I repurchase this but I really did enjoy this. I do have another icebreakers ice cube arctic grape gum in here. I went through the Trader Joe's salted caramel and pistachio candle. I really enjoyed this candle y'all. I burn it down as far as I could burn it down and um, yeah if I see this in Trader Joe's again I would definitely repurchase this because I love the scent of this this was really really nice I did use up the Oleg Henriksen hydro barrier nourishing face oil I did use this up I will say I did like this I didn't love it as much as I love my Sunday Riley face drops I really love the Sunday Riley face drops. I don't think anything really can compare to that. I don't think that I would repurchase this though, but I am glad that I gave this a try. I do have the Pure Skin Toner with Oat Milk from e.l.f. Skin. I did pick this up when I did place an order with e.l.f. This was nice. I didn't love this like I love the e.l.f. Keep Your Balance Toner, but this wasn't bad. I don't think I would repurchase this though, um, but I was, I'm glad that I did give this a try. Another product that I have gone through it is the Youth to the People Kale Plus Green Tea Spinach Vitamin Superfood Cleanser. This is top tier. This is probably like my number one cleanser. I love this cleanser. I have another one in my collection now. I'm not sure if I'm going to buy another one during the sale. I think I'm going to wait. This just, it cleanses the skin. It doesn't strip it. It foams up really nicely. I just can't say enough about this cleanser. Like, this was a game changer for me. I love this cleanser. I will continue to repurchase it and uh, yeah so I've gone through that something else that I go through is the uh, Tabasco sauce y'all I love Tabasco sauce does anybody else love Tabasco sauce like me I love Tabasco sauce I have to sometimes I have to I have to put this on my hash browns especially when I go out to eat I have to put it on my hash browns or my eggs like Tabasco sauce just does it for me like I love other hot sauces like I love the Louisiana hot sauce but it's something about this Tabasco sauce that just keeps me in a chokehold so I go I, I go through this a lot I do okay I have gone through one of the Ulta Beauty lip oils in I don't know what shade this is but it was like a purplish kind of shade but I have definitely used these up I will say that the Ulta brand lip oils are not bad they're actually pretty good so I think I would repurchase some of them in the future I have enjoyed this I have some dental floss here I go through the Oral B Glide Pro Health deep clean floss I have to use really kind of this floss and then I have to use floss threaders because I did have braces and so I have to use those because I have two permanent retainers in my mouth so yeah I go through this floss I also have an Arm & Hammer Ultra Max Power Fresh deodorant now I do pick these up from the Dollar Tree I do like these I'm typically a powder fresh girl when it comes to my deodorant however I've been branching out recently the spray deodorant by Dove I have the scent I think it's something with shea butter or something like that but I really like that one but I outside of that I am typically a powder fresh girl so I I've gone through these I have another floss that I've gone through then I have this diffuser that I got from Primark which I would not repurchase this again because it just was not that potent it wasn't as potent as it smelled in the store but this was in vanilla and uh, I went through this really really quickly so I would not repurchase this but um, I 
I've gone through it. Also gone through the Paradotics toothpaste. I go through these as well. So as you guys can see, there's literally nothing else I could get out of that. And then I've gone through the Vaseline Lip Therapy in Cocoa Butter. I really do like these. When I see these in the Dollar Tree, I pick these up. Something else that I've gone through is a perfume. This is the Clinique My Happy perfume in cocoa and cashmere this is definitely a repurchase for me this does not last as long as i would like for it to but i'm telling you when i say this smells amazing this smells amazing like clinique did that with this this is a scent that i don't typically like wear out but like once i take my shower and stuff at night i really like to spray it at nighttime. oh my god this just smells so good y'all this is definitely a repurchase for me i'm sad to see it go i was holding on to it for the longest time because i'm just like i love this so much and then something else i have gone through this is the bumble and bumble hairdressers invisible oil conditioner this was something that i used on my hair and um, I feel like it was okay you know it was it was it was okay something else that I've gone through is the cocoa butter Vaseline I don't even buy the original I like the baby powder scent but since they've come out with the cocoa butter one I don't even buy the cocoa powder scent anymore not the cocoa powder I don't even buy the baby powder scent anymore I just stick with the cocoa butter one because I love cocoa butter y'all already know I go through are these hour med facial towels extra large I go through these I actually just got a package delivered with some more of these because I'm out I like these a lot and I have another box right here and I'm sure I'll, I'll have some more boxes coming up here's another box I tried to break this down but this is what it's looking like okay so I have the Listerine total care mouthwash and fresh mint I have used this up and I really do like this mouthwash so I continue to repurchase it so yeah gone through that this is the hydrating facial wipes you get 25 in here and this has hyaluronic acid in it and these are really nice these are not bad at all I really do like these I have another pack that I picked up when I did see them in the Dollar Tree so I mean if I see these I will pick these up because these are not bad at all y'all another bag of the Miss Vicky spicy deal chips Ooh, I could go for this today something else that has become a favorite of mine this is food this is from Trader Joe's this is the chocolate cheesecake bites I think this is like the perfect little snack they're so small I mean but and they're so good I've been going through a few of these boxes and they are so delicious the next time I go to Trader Joe's which will be really soon I'm gonna pick up another box of these because I really like these this is by BioPure these are the pocket size singles this is the antibacterial hand wipes um, yeah I've, I've gone through these I have another periodontics toothpaste that I've gone through I have gone through the bolero body wash and lotus flower plus bamboo I feel like this was okay yeah for the money this wasn't bad used every drop okay also gone through the Trader Joe's Brazil nut body scrub I really do like this I love the scent of this I think this is like my second one if I'm not mistaken I may have one more left I don't know but I definitely have enjoyed this and I've gone through this so I definitely would repurchase this again I have another Arm & Hammer Ultra Max powder fresh deodorant okay I have a few candles in here that I've gone through this one I picked up from Walmart this is the all swell embrace candle this one had vanilla sugar cane and almond in it it's a very light it was a very light scent but it was a very nice scent so I really did like this I've burned this down as far down as I could burn it and um, they do have the smaller versions of these candles so you don't have to spend the money for the big ones if you don't want but I have enjoyed this candle and then I have this candle from Target I do believe this was in oh hero candle iconic coconut campfire oh this smells amazing I picked this up because this reminded me of marshmallow fireside and marshmallow fireside is one of my favorite candles from Bath and Body Works but when I smell this one this one smells amazing I burned this down again as far down as I could and if I see this again in Target I mean the packaging was really pretty 
I did use this around the holidays. It just kind of carried me on into the new year. If you like marshmallow fireside like I do, then you would probably love this one as well. I have gone through the Bolero Moisture Plus Hydrate shampoo this has coconut milk and sweet almond oil in it i feel like for the money this wasn't it wasn't bad it wasn't like great but it wasn't like the worst either so yeah i've gone through this more soap in here from dove i do have the shea butter and then i have another original I also have a hydrocortisone cream in here i picked these up from dollar tree i do have the clinique take the day off cleansing balm i've gone through the travel size of this this is one of my favorite cleansing balms again Clinique has definitely surprised me with some of their products that I have tried and yeah Clinique is Clinique is up there for me. I definitely like this. I do have a, I guess a medium sized jar. When I'm finished with the medium sized jar, I probably just repurchase another medium sized jar. I don't want the largest container that they have. These last me a while. This one lasted me a while and the size jar that I have now, that lasts me a while as well. So I don't really need that big jar. I've gone through another body wash. This was by Bolero as well. This was in vanilla bean plus coconut. The scent wasn't bad either. So I did enjoy this. I did go through this fairly quickly. So I've gone through one of the facial mist and rose water and aloe by Bolero. Again, I get these from the Dollar Tree and I really do like these facial mists. I just want them to come back out with the cucumber and aloe one because that was my favorite one. But I like the rose water and aloe one as well. And then I have a, another hydro cortisone cream. Again, I picked these up from the Dollar Tree. I've gone through that. And I have gone through one of my brow stylist definer pencils by L'Oreal. This has definitely become one of my favorite drugstore eyebrow pencils. I love this. I mean, this gives me precisely my brow pencil but just on a drugstore price. And I really like this pencil. I will repurchase this over and over again. Now the shade that I get, I believe it's in black brown. No, the shade I get is in soft black. Soft black, when you try to pick it up at Ulta or Walmart, even Target, like this, is, this color is so hard to get your hands on that I've had to order this from Amazon because it's hard to get my hands on it in the store. If this is a pencil that you wanna try or this is a shade that you try in this pencil maybe try ordering online from Ulta or Target even Walmart definitely Amazon and the last two products that I have is another periodontics toothpaste and then I have a seasoning actually this is from Trader Joe's as well this is the green goddess seasoning blend I love this stuff. I put this on my, when I make my raw veggie salad, I use this. Roasted vegetables, I use this. Whatever I do, I use this. I even add a little bit of this to my eggs. I have another one I'm currently using, like Trader Joe's. Th this is a really nice season. That was the last bag of empties, you guys. We have gone through a lot of empties today. And um, I do like to film these kind of videos. So I am going to get rid of this so that I can start a new bag and start putting <laughs> new trash in that bag. <laughs> but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget guys to subscribe to my channel, comment down below, I'd love to hear from you guys. And thumbs up this video and click that notification bell also. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye guys. <music>